So in this video, I'm going to compare these two transistors. This is the 2N2222 transistor. This is the 2N3904 transistor. They're both NPN transistors. So for the most part, they're the same. So to begin with, we'll take a look at the voltage at the rail. And you see it is 9 volts. So now we want to measure the base to emitter current. So that's very small. That's going to be in microamps. That's because this is a 470 kilo ohm resistor. 470,000 ohms. And remember, this is how we turn the transistor on and off and set the current from collector to emitter. So we have 18.1 microamps going through there. And now we'll shuffle the 2N2222 transistor down and replace it with the uh, 2N3904. So again, this is the current going through the resistor to the base and then through the emitter. And you can see it's pretty much the same uh, exact amount of current, about 18.2. So, so far, these transistors are uh, behaving the same. So now, I added a jumper connecting the collector of the 2N3904 directly to the positive rail. So now, we'll run current through the transistor controlled only by the high value resistance of the 470 kilo ohm resistor. So the current we're going to deal with now is much larger. So I set the meter to milliamps, which is a milliamp is 1000 times larger than a microamp. And so we'll measure the current going through there. And you see it's about uh, 6.22. It goes up as the transistor warms up a little bit. But uh, in any case, we're going to move that one out of the way and now put the 2N2222 transistor in the same spot. And now we'll measure the current coming out of the emitter. And you see it's quite a bit lower. This is about uh, 4.95 milliamps. So that tells us that the gain of the 2N3904 is higher than the 2N2222. For a certain amount of current coming to the base, the 2N3904 will let more current go through the collector to emitter than the 2N2222. So now we can check our numbers with this multimeter I have. This meter will measure the gain of transistors. HFE is the same as gain. And you see there's this little board here with uh, slots in it to put the transistors. So we want the emitter up here, the base there, and the collector there. So we're going to point the uh, transistor to the left. That'll put the emitter on top. And to begin with, this is the 2N3904. And it's a little tricky to get the pins into there, but uh, you just kind of wiggle them around until they go in. And uh, I calculated about 344 gain, and this is going to drop down to about 344. I measured it earlier. Uh, so you can see the math was on there. What that's saying is for a certain amount of current at the base, it'll let about 344 times that current from the collector to emitter. And generally use that to power uh, another part of a circuit. Now, for the 2N2222, if you remember, we got uh, less collector current with it. Even though we had the same amount of base current. So you know the gain is smaller. And I calculated the gain to be about 200 and uh, 75 times as much uh, collector current as base current. So it amplifies the current about 275 times. And you can see that there. This number is really close. Looks like it's going to drop a little before it levels. But it's about 275. 